Well, why is this in the shop? Welcome back to the kitchen, that's everybody. Dinner. dinner. We're making dessert. Dessert what? first. Wow, that's really aggressive of you. Welcome back to Wildlife Hotel. Boom. In our fried rice video, we made the joke of what jelly beans. Jelly beans. In fried rice. And then this comment here from, I'll, I'll, I'll insert your name, I promise, made me think. Hmm. What if? What, what if? if? There are so many dessert rices, right? We have mochi, we have sweet rice, we have mango, sticky rice. Yeah. What if instead of mango, something we used worse. jelly beans? Yeah, something worse. I am excited. I can't wait. It's gonna. Here we are at the stove. We made it. We're back. The stove. So we're gonna warm up some coconut milk while we wait for our rice. Medium-ish heat. Some recipes for mango sticky rice call for low, some call for medium. The main point is just don't burn your coconut milk. Got my pre-opened coconut milk, full fat. 13.5 ounces of coconut milk, but only half a can. Depending on the fat content of your coconut milk, you may have some thickness up here. You wanna make sure that gets stirred into everything. What? Also just shake it before you open it. Or shake it before you open it. Half of the can. Don't worry, that second half's going in something else. And we're gonna stir pretty much constantly to avoid burning and to avoid any buildup on the sides of the pan. We're gonna stir and we're gonna stir and we're gonna stir. Chop and we're gonna fold. That's a throwback to the last video. If you haven't watched it, it's right here somewhere. A tablespoon of sugar. The recipe calls for three tablespoons of sugar, but we're also adding a bunch of jelly beans to this. So maybe we don't wanna go so heavy on the sugar. We just want our coconut milk to be sweetened, not candy. And then we stir. We stir and we stir. Making sure our sugar dissolves, making it pretty, making it beautiful. I'm gonna call this about done. I don't wanna thicken this because it's gonna be mixed up with my rice. I want, oh, I almost let it burn. We're gonna make a little something later that's gonna be thicker. Let's figure <laughs> out, we're doing, do I'm that. gonna give you some rice and you do with it what you will. Here we All go. Right. Oh, it's very sticky. It's very sticky. And I'm gonna give you a little bit more. Yeah, I think we need more. Does that seem right to you? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna set the rest of this aside to make something good with. Now I'm gonna add the sweetened coconut milk. Faster than that though, I'm bored. You can go, you just like, just pour it in there. Yeah, there you go. Now they can see it. Mm -hmm. Hopefully that's not too much. You're leaving a lot on the table here. I'm a professional. I didn't know if we needed all of it. I was worried that it'd be too much. It's coconut. Why would I not need all of the coconuts? And then you just kind of make up. What are you doing? You just f it up. Is that why you wanted to add more? This is a very serious. You just kind of mix it. Hey, excuse me, this is a very serious video. This is the most serious video we've ever done. I don't done. think you're taking this very seriously. We right? are solving world hunger by making people not want to eat. Hey, I think this is gonna turn out delicious. I think don't knock it till you try it. And do, do making a dessert rice, they exist. Do mix Sweet until you rice get an- Sweet exists. You're still talking. Mix until you get an even consistency, like if you are making mango sticky if rice. If you're making real sticky like, rice. Like keep going I, until all of your coconut milk juice sauce is integrated. Incorporate. Yeah. We're incorporating all of the milk that's too, into our rice. That's a little too businessman it for is, me. It is businessman. I just like to say it, all scrambled up. It is businessman, but all it is All scrambled the... up. Yeah, this is good now. And so what gonna... horrors did you want to do to this? So what we're doing with this now is we're letting this sit for about five to 10 minutes to absorb to all of the milk of into course. the rice. We can cover it if we want to, but it's not really necessary. We're just gonna let it do its thing. So in the meantime, we're gonna make a jelly bean coconut milk syrup to pour on top of this. I can't wait. <laughs> Let's go do that. Okay, again, I'm gonna have to ask you to take this seriously. I... Back to the stove. Okay. So are you ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. For jelly bean syrup? This is kind of an experiment, not, but no, I'm not ready. we're gonna I'm make not. a syrup to put on top of our sticky rice made out of jelly beans. Wait, stop, I'm not ready. How many jelly beans did we put in here? I put 10 lime and 20 mango. Out of our two pounds. <laughs> out of two pounds of jelly beans, we're using 30. <laughs> but it was the only way we could get specific flavors. We wanted to get lime and mango for our mango sticky rice. It just made sense. Yeah. So I'm really hoping this works out the way I want it to. I'm gonna boil these jelly beans. Sucks. Where's my stir stick? You have my stir stick. Oh boy. Get a close up of this. So far, nothing, nothing wrong, nothing bad. I'm gonna turn my heat down a tiny bit. There's nothing good. This is looking so good. It smells so good. I'm so scared of this though. So what I need to do is I need two pairs of hands right now. I need to thicken up some more of the coconut milk so we can add this to that to make a creamy syrup that's gonna go on top of our mango sticky rice. We're gonna add those to this. We're gonna add this to that and hopefully it makes a nice creamy syrup and not a, 
a horrible Try monster. Try and match one of those in half. It does smell like mango lime. All right, what I'm probably gonna do, because I'm afraid of this turning into too sticky of a mess and ruining my pan, is put this into the coconut milk right now and let the melting happen in there. I'm sipping back. You don't think this is gonna work? So what I'm gonna do is turn that one off, Oop. then bring this over here, mix these two together. Did you die? No, I didn't. Wow, see that's what I thought would happen. I'm gonna bring my coconut milk up to a boil. What are you doing there? Rice. Oh. It kind of just turned into like a pale green. What am I doing back here? What are you doing back there? I was gonna put some jelly beans in our rice. You're gonna garnish our rice with jelly beans? Yeah, I think, uh, I think I might. All right, let's do it. The nice thing is I didn't ruin this. my good pan. I was so worried melting jelly beans would destroy my pan. I mean, it's destroying my mind. Isn't that enough? No. This sucks. All right, well, we're gonna be here for a while while okay. we wait for my syrup to reduce. So... Play the Benny Hill music, but don't don't pay for it. Yeah, that's pretty much... That's pretty close, right? Whatever. That's pretty close. Nothing matters anymore. All right, I'm gonna put these nonsenses into two bowls. This is a bowl thing, right? This is a bowl thing? This is a bowl. Yeah, I would do bowls. The unfortunate thing is, I do think it's gonna be really good. Oh. No. Are you ready to do the damn thing? I am, I'm so ready. Are you ready? Well, let's, it's the real question. for this, this goopy boy, let's put some on here. Hold on, hold on. Oh, you want to get a shot of that? I do. It looks kind of like oobleck. No, that's very thin. How much do you want? Say when on your jelly bean sauce. When? Ooh, that's a good amount of jelly bean sauce, isn't it? Mm. So I think there's only one thing left to do. Give it a shot. Panic. I will say we handled our rice probably a bit much, so it's turning into more of like a porridge. I'll say that I got a green lime jelly bean right in my first bite. Oh, oh no. Oh no, this is so good. This is very good. Oh my God. What did we do? I might also like it cold. Mm -hmm. Cause this is warm. Like a cold mochi almost. So if you were coming here for a food fail, unfortunately, all you got was <laughs> news that jelly beans go well with sticky rice and how to make jelly bean syrup. There's one thing, we scoured the internet for melting jelly beans and there was nothing. It was good as hell. No reliable I would put source that on ice cream. for melting jelly beans. We made jelly bean syrup and we might be the first. You could drizzle it over pie. You could put it on ice cream. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. The bites with the jelly bean syrup are the best ones. There is no bad bite here. I was worried it would be too sweet mm -mm, because of all not. the sugar we added. I'm glad I reduced the sugar because the recipe called for three times the sugar I used. But we used jelly beans. But we used jelly beans instead and that seemed to be about right. And it was, it was, oh my gosh, this is so good. I don't want to stop eating. Thanks again for joining us at Wildlife mm. Hotel. Oh, I don't want to stop eating this, but I need to do an outro. Oh, I don't have to. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like, maybe subscribe. You could watch our fried rice video over here that inspired this whole thing. Tell a friend. We don't have any advertising budget, so mm -hmm. telling a friend is really great for us. Tell your grandma. We'll make her angry. We'll make somebody's grandma angry. Or maybe your grandma will be like, that's very creative and I support you. I'm one of the good grandmas. I feel like we're gonna make somebody angry with this recipe, but legitimately, we started this video as a joke. Yeah. This is so good. Yeah, oh this is way God. good. We did well here. Jokes and our japes are the best ideas of most men. Stir up out of jelly beans. Weird. Mine's gone. Please Please, sir, I'd like some more jelly bean I sticky love rice. Some more. <laughs> With jelly bean syrup, sir. Have a wonderful night. I know I will.